hello viewers uh, assalamu alaikum uh, welcome to my youtube channel ishfaq samun vidax uh, today we are uh, going to discuss uh, fundamental rights uh, in indian constitution it is our topic uh, it is lecture 6th uh, rather uh, for class 11th subject political science uh, book 1 constitution india uh, topic fundamental rights in indian constitution uh, in part third from article 12 to 35 so be with me till the end of the lecture we'll discuss all these things in this lecture so let's get started uh, article 12 to 35 contained in part uh, third of the constitution uh, deal with fundamental rights uh, there are six fundamental rights guaranteed by the Indian Constitution uh, that include uh, right to equality, right to freedom, right against exploitation, right to freedom of religion, cultural and educational rights, and right to constitutional uh, remedies. Article 12, definition of the state. Uh, the definition of state uh, is inclusive and provides that state includes the following. Uh, government and Parliament of India, that is the executive and legislature of the union. Government and legislature of each state, that is the executive and legislature of the uh, various states of India. Article 13. Uh, laws inconsistent with or in derogation of the fundamental rights. Uh, Article 13 of the Indian Constitution describes the means for judicial review. Uh, it enjoins a duty on the Indian state to respect and implement the fundamental right, and at the same time, it confers a power. Uh, on the courts to declare a law or an act wide if it infringes the fundamental rights of the citizens uh, we will discuss all these fundamental rights one by one in detail uh, initially the constitution of india provided seven basic fundamental rights now there are only six the right to property under article 31 was removed from the list of fundamental rights by 44th constitutional amendment act 1978 uh, that is presently a legal right under article 300a and was made and included in part 12th of the indian constitution article 14 uh, equality before law uh, it says that the state shall not deny to any person equality before the law or the equal protection of the laws within the territory of India on grounds of religion, race, caste, gender or place of birth. Article 15. Uh, prohibition of discrimination on the grounds of religion, race, caste, gender or place of birth. Uh, prohibition of discrimination on grounds of religion, race, caste, uh, gender, or place of birth. The state shall not discriminate against any citizen uh, on grounds only of religion, race, caste, uh, gender, place of birth, or any of uh, them. Article 16. Uh, equality of opportunity in matters of public employment. Uh, Article 16 uh, prohibits the discrimination in employment in any government office. However, the government can allow reservation for any community uh, if they are not adequately represented in service or posts under the state. Article 17 Abolition of the Untouchability. Article 17 of the Indian Constitution abolished untouchability, uh, forbade its practice in any form, and made 
enforcement of any disability uh, arising out of untouchability and offense punishable in accordance with the law. Article 18. Uh, abolition of titles. Uh, Article 18 uh, talks about the abolition of titles. Uh, it says no title not being a military or academic distinction shall be conferred by the state. Uh, no citizen of India shall accept any title from any foreign state. Further, these rights do not uh, prohibit the state from making the state uh, do not prohibit the state from making special provisions in the interest of women, uh, children, scheduled costs, scheduled tribes, and socially and educationally backward classes. Uh, similarly, residents' uh, disqualification may be prescribed for appointments in the service of the state. Uh, right uh, to equality from Article 14 to 18. There are five articles which we have discussed above in the, these uh, uh, fundamental rights. So, the purpose of this category of fundamental rights, right to equality, is to establish a uh, rule of law in India. Uh, that is to say, all uh, citizens should be treated equally uh, before law. Uh, no one should get any privilege or earn any disability on grounds of religion, race, caste, gender, or place of birth. Uh, it aims at abolition of feudal inequalities prevented in society so with this uh, we have concluded uh, today's video lecture uh, that is right to equality uh, from the part of fundamental rights that are guaranteed in the indian constitution uh, in next lecture uh, we will discuss a right to freedom uh, of the Indian Constitution, that is under not Article 19, which guarantees uh, six uh, freedoms. Uh, if you want to talk to us, uh, the WhatsApp number is visible on screen, email ID is on screen. Uh, we'll inshallah coming soon. Uh, one request is there. Please like, comment, uh, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks. Allah Hafiz.